the ideal lens feed of our RGB lens. As we can see, there's a fin pulling throughout the lens, meaning that there's an even pressure exerted all around the cornea. There's also an optimal edge clearance of around 0.5mm all around the lens, and a movement of 1.0 to 1.5mm. This is essential for a good tears exchange in the eye. Okay, so now I'll be talking about how you're going to recognize a flat fit lens on the patient. In fact, in a flat fit lens, there will be excessive lens movement of 1.5mm to 2.0mm. So, um, when you add fluorescence into this uh, flat fit lens, you will be able to see peripheral pulling and the central bearing. No visible edge current is able to see as there are excessive peripheral pulling. For steep fit RGP lens, you will observe central pulling with a peripheral bearing, meaning that the lens is actually touching the cornea on the periphery without any fluorescence. Each clearance wise, for a steep fit RGP, you will observe about 0.3 to 0.5 mm of each clearance. Sometimes it may not be even all around, depending on individual fit. movement wise. For a steep fit, you may observe about 1 to 1.5 mm of vertical movement.